You, O king, happen to be beholding, and look, a certain immense image, that image which was large, and the brightness of which was extraordinary, was standing in front of you, and its appearance was dreadful. As regards that image, its head was of good gold, its breasts and its arms were of silver, its belly and its thighs were of copper, its legs were of iron, its feet were partly of iron and partly of moulded clay. You kept on looking until a stone was cut out, not by hands, and it struck the image on its feet of iron and of moulded clay and crushed them, were altogether crushed and became like the chaff from the summer threshing floor. And the wind carried them away so that no trace at all was found of them. And as for the stone that struck the image, it became a large mountain and filled the whole earth.